So it's Simone here, and I finally got all my stuff together to show you guys everything that I got from PremierCon and Posh Night, and kind of go over what I learned and my different takeaways. I did one training earlier that kind of went over some of it, um, but I didn't have like everything on me. So I did get, um, so PremierCon took place basically throughout, and then Posh Night happened to be one of the nights um, of PremierCon, um, and that's when we have the new catalog launched, um, and all the fun products that were um, announced. So I did get the Posh Night bundle, um, that was the Posh Night bundle, that the that 7 deal that we had. Um, those are all the different products that we got at, at Posh Night. Um, so if you are a party crasher or a... Um, uh, premiere. So if you were there for training or if you were just there for Posh Night, then everyone got these seven products plus samples um, of the products. So samples here as well. So lots of funness over here. Um, but yeah, so basically Premier Con opened up and we got our and the things that we got in our registration were a tote, so a Mardi Gras um, Premier Con tote, a pin, because of course we are all about pins and recognition. Um, we had name tags that are here. Oh, here we go. Name tags here. Um, so that we can wear them and so people knew who we were. Because um, a lot of the times, even if we know each other, we might not recognize each other face to face, right? Um, but yeah, so we had we got all those things and then um, we did have some room drops. So if you guys ever have a chance to go to any Posh event, um, Posh really spoils us uh, with product and lots of goodies. So um, the room drops worked a little bit different this time, so instead of actually being in our room, um, when we got back to our rooms that evening, they were actually, um, we, there were tickets for us to grab them. Um, and so the first room drop actually was, I have, so we had the sample container with the avo avocado, I have notes because I don't remember everything, um, with a pack of post, oops, post-its, um, posh post-its. And let's see, I, had a pro, I have a posh sharpie somewhere, which is actually one of the one of the things that we got that I was like, oh my gosh! But it's a perfectly posh branded sharpie, like actual sharpie brand. So how cool is that? Um, and we got a bag of chips, so some Mardi Gras style chips, and pralines, which oh here we go, pralines, and I think that was it for that. Yeah, so that was the first room drop. Um, and then the second room drop, we got more product. So Hey Bay Snarky, um, Soda, to to Tango, so another product, and a flask. <sighs> a perfectly posh branded flask, guys. Like, for real. Look at that. I saw that there were some other people that had pink ones, so that's kind of crazy, right? But I got a silver one. Um, not a drinker, so I'm not entirely sure I'll do this. I might have throw this in um, my box of posh memorabilia or even just toss this out. Um, maybe in a team incentive. Um, so if you guys are loving that, let me know. Um, but yeah, so those are the room drops. And the first night we were there, we had our parade. Um, so some different things that we got in the parade were cups. So Mardi Gras, these are color changing cups. Um, we got, let's see, lots of stuff in here. Frisbee, more of these containers, and I think, oh, and then just a bunch of really random stuff. Like, let's see, so our registration bags all came with um, a perfectly posh Mardi Gras beads, um, but they were tossing these out at the posh parade as well, so we got some of this. Um, the prey had other random things too, like, let's see, oh, like this, they were tossing this flash and duck out, um, perfectly posh branded gold coins and some other random coins, um, 
mustaches, like tons of random stuff, right? So that was with our parade stuff. Oh, I just lost some of it. Um, okay, and then some other fun stuff that happened during the session. So we are not just there for to party. We are actually there to learn. And there's a lot of, uh, there's general sessions, there's breakout sessions. Um, so there's a lot of stuff going on and a lot of knowledge to take in. And one of the things that we always well, has all, we've always gotten since then is a notepad, take notes. Um, we got a pen, a posh pen with our registration as well. Um, but yeah, so then those are the things that we got for our trainings. And then in the trainings, one of the things that Anne talked about that I really, I'm going to share with you guys as well is, um, it, uh, I don't remember what the movie is called. I think it's like How Does She Do It or something like that. But it's a story about Play-Doh. Um, pretty much. Like, this Paul Rudd gives Reese Witherspoon's character Play-Doh. And I will show you guys the video um, of it because I don't really want to ruin it, but then we got this to kind of commemorate it, um, which once you guys watch the clip, I hope it resonates with you because it really resonated with me. So we got some Play-Doh for that. <clears throat> and then... I think that's it in this bag. All right, and then, of course, we get our working stuff like so we got oh well we got this so this is our agenda for the the, the trainings um but some other things that we got were of course some training tools so we got lots of handouts to take notes on and things that i'm going to go over with all of you guys um, including this i don't know if you guys have seen this yet this is our why how what this is going to be our three-step way to share posh with people um, and this is basically how the starter kits are now set up. So we're going to do a training specifically on this. So first I want you guys to remember or think about what your why is, why you're here, um, what posh means to you, okay? So there's that. And then another thing we're going to start some training on is our brand storybook. This is another thing that, um, that Anne did a training on, and it basically kind of talks about how our brand is our soul um, and how a brand is what people think of when they see you okay so another fun thing so branding has been on my mind a lot and I really think that it's something that we need to talk about a bit more but I want you guys to think about why you're here why what posh means to you why are you what's your why posh and then we're gonna go over that and we're gonna go over our storybook as well um, and then Let's see, we've got a pack of catalogs, we've got our spring and summer transition guide, which if you guys have not looked at that yet, that is online, so you can take a look at that. That's going to be super helpful for you guys. Um, and then we also got this. So this is probably one of the most coveted things that we got at PremierCon. Um, this is what everyone is getting in their starter kits. So these are in the new starter kit, so if you joined from... January, I believe, 20th on, then you're going to get this packet of stuff. So this is their three-step starter kit. Um, it has all the information in here that you're going to get. I'm going to go over this separately. Um, but not only are you getting that, you're also getting your... Well, new recruits are getting their starter kit boxes. Again, I'm going to go over this separately, but this was something that I was like telling... So my husband came to um, PremierCon with me, and I was telling him that we have to pack this. We are making making sure we bring this home and he was like why it's a box and I was like you don't even understand what this means so this is it this is the I'm this is the starter kit box that everyone all the new recruits are getting all the new team members are getting it has a handle at the top here and it opens like this um, again I'm gonna go over separately about this and kind of do more trainings on how you can talk about the three-step starter kit but of course what comes in the starter kit other than the the, the promotional stuff um, we've got the bags so we've got pampering for me, we've got sample bag with the wristlet, and we have the products for my business. Um, if you guys want these bags, these were available in the portal. I don't remember, if, I don't know if they still are, um, but you can always use your perks points for them, use them as a business tool. Um, they're really great for something that you can use for yourself, but it's also good to show potential customers or potential team members um, how awesome it is, right? Um, and then some other things that we also got that I kind of talked about a little bit before. So I kind of talked about the Posh Tribe before, right? Our Posh Tribe, our Tribe Vibe. This is going to kind of 
um, this is going to be another training all by itself. So this is a tassel I talked about, I think, yesterday, the other day, um, but how we are all kind of part of a tassel, right? Um, and then another training that we did, again, I'm going to break up all of these little trainings and do it, bring them to you guys, um, was about pearls and oysters and how um, basically it's great with grace. I haven't opened mine yet. I haven't shucked my oyster yet for my pearl, but I'm excited to do that, and I will be doing that hopefully soon. I haven't had a chance yet. My house has been a mess since I've gotten home. Um, but so this is another training, and then... We had our last morning there was our breakfast at Tiffany's um, event. That's where I got my gold premiere necklace, if you guys see that. Um, I, I hit gold with the help of all of you guys last year. Um, and I didn't go to the last premiere con, but I did go to this one, so I wanted to get my necklace at the event um, in New Orleans, right? And so, anyways, I just want to thank you guys. For being an amazing team, um, it this and all of the stuff would not I would not have it without you guys. But okay, anyway, so that's the breakfast at Tiffany's, and we got these little mugs or tumblers, which we've never gotten um, before for breakfast at Tiffany. Breakfast with Tiffany. Um, anyway, yeah. So I think that's all I got. There's probably more. Um, I kind of basically came home and threw, like, everything on the ground, unpacked everything, and then just left it there for a couple days, um, before I kind of sorted through it. So, this is kind of my, this is what I got here. Um, this is the last Premier Con. Um, so, things are going to be a little bit different coming, you know, going forward, but we will have leaderships, we will, or leadership, uh, trainings, so still aim for the, the, the top tiers, guys, still aim for premieres, um, and above, because you're still going to have all the leadership training, um, and then the next, we're going to have unconvention, um, that's coming back, uh, in early August, it's going to be in Salt Lake City, and that's going to be super fun, that's open to everybody, so, um, you guys are going to be able to see how awesome all the like posh events are, like how spectacular and big the posh events can be, um, and how exciting it can be with all everybody else, and how you know to learn and and to and to kind of connect and and feel like, because you know a lot of us work at home, so it's nice to actually be in with everybody else, right? You know, and kind of realize what it is that you're a part of. Um, but yeah, so I think I think that's it. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Um, I will talk to you guys later. Have a great day.